Hey, that's a new model, isn't it? Geez, I didn't even know it was out yet. Hey, yeah, I used to work for the company, so I get stuff before they release it to the general public. Wow, get a big discount? I wish, not anymore. I don't know how you afford that on our pay scale. I can hardly afford my bills. You also eat out every other meal. Shut up, Green. This isn't even gonna matter. In a few seconds, I'm just gonna Please. Be... Zach, please take me with you. It's a curse, Erica. It's dangerous. It's bad for your hair. It's lonely. It doesn't have to be. Why don't you throw a brother a bone? Look, baby, dig this. You got no money, I got no business for you. All right? You want your bone? Here. Go get your bone. Some company? Not really. You want to talk about it? Like I said, not really. So, look, I don't know what's up, but a blind man can see that there is something going on between you, Roberts, and Bradley. And you know, if you can't talk to Senior Roberts about it, you can always talk to Senior Chief Wren. It's real easy to talk to. He gives great advice and all. I've spoken to him a few times myself. You know what? Come on. I'll walk up there with you now. <laughs> hey, bet you feel different about females having different PT standards now, don't you? They robbed you, man. Son of a bitch. <laughs> hey, drink sit down on me, okay? Hey, man, it sounds like a plan. You'll get her next time, man. I'll choke on a Twinkie Blake. Y'all notice how he casually threw in the word we, right? For the first week, everyone was getting in on the act, okay? Russell was a complete jerk. McNulty, Hayes, but Bradley, Clark's mentor, mind you, he was the ringleader. Weren't you, Bradley? 